Okay. Um, I think we're back. I had a phone call I had to take last time. Um, I think it was serious. I'm not really sure. All right, so let's just start. Um, okay. Oh my gosh, I've already lost. Okay, there we go. My gosh, that was so unexpected. on the phone for like an uh, hour or something. I don't remember. Probably more than an hour. I feel so tired now. I always feel tired after getting off the phone or having to deal with a phone call. Just the idea of like a phone call coming in you just feel kind of like you have to prepare yourself and stuff for the uh, the issue you know i wonder if that even picked up on the um, audio This should be, uh, I think it's three shell, three eyeball. Oh shit. Easy. I feel like I did that faster than I normally do. What is that thing supposed to be? A mythological scorpion? I wonder if there's a randomizer for this game. I always wanted to try that out. I don't really know how those work though, but um, I definitely play this game randomized, if that's even possible. I might even uh, play this game on the second difficulty after I beat it on this one. I just gotta experience how this game is in HD first. Uh, after that call, I should have switched out controllers. I didn't do that. So caught up in uh, whatever we were talking about. Well, Prince Kamali, don't you have something you want to say? Um, I heard everything from Medley. Miruku, thank you so much. I'm sorry I mistrusted you. <clears throat> I hope I can be like you someday. You will, Kamali. I just know it. Right, Miruku? <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't even nod my head on that. Can you imagine talking to somebody and they're just staring at you with their mouth open the entire time? And Link's still doing it. His face has not changed after he got the pearl. Everybody else is smiling and Link's just like, ooh. Yeah, I already did that. 
The Great Valu also names you Miruku as or a true hero. I agree with him. As far as we're concerned, Miruku, you really are a hero. I'm going to go visit Valu. I'll come see you sometime with the best pair of wings ever. Hey, Prince Komali, thanks so much, Miruku. See you again someday. Yes, we will. It's really cool that we did get to see them again. And not just like an endgame cutscene, but an actual thing. Oh, a customer. Welcome to Beetle's shop ship. I deal with pretty much anything and everything. Do you have anything you don't need? Oh wait, he... Have you been able to sell stuff to him? What the hell? How do I sell? I don't have anything to say. Just buy something. Bye bye. Okay. Let's get this. Since I have so many rubies. I think you cap out at 200, right? I don't remember. You're the greatest. I'll never forget you. I'm going to make a member's card just for you. When you buy lots of things and build up your points, something good will happen to you. Something very good indeed. My shop is kind to its customers. No other shop will do this sort of thing for you. I'll have you know. You have one point saved. You can try to save up to 30. Okay. This guy is trying to bait me into only purchasing his items. Now you have two points. Um, I'll do a bunch of buying later. I don't really want to just keep buying, buying, buying. Three should be good. Or maybe I should get more for those pesky rats. I don't know. Time to say goodbye to this music. Listen, man, you're not one of the native islanders, are you? My problem is, I just have no idea how I'm supposed to get up there and I have a job to... <laughs> what are they gonna have you do? Does that help? No, it didn't. Are you gonna do an interview with a um, no shirt on, like one of those sandals, and some uh, some short shorts all tatted up? I'm sure you'll get the job. It would seem that Ganon sent those monsters to this place, but that would mean there is no time to lose. He must depart at once, or the place where the next pearl sleeps. We sail to the south. All right. Let me in. Oh, you're not gonna let me in until I wake the winds. South. South. What is going on? Oh, really? You have to tap it? That's weird. That's not how it was originally. That's something I don't like. map okay oh wow we're going far we're going all the way down there holy hold it right there small fry oh my god I don't know where you got your mitts on that sea chart but it looks to me like it's pretty much got nothing but seas drawn on it it's pathetic in fact it's almost an insult to call that thing a sea chart if you ask me What's the matter, small fry? I'm just trying to be nice here. I'm telling you that you've got a problem and you do. Don't give me that stupefied look. It makes you look like you ought to be in diapers. What the hell is this problem? Just listen, okay? I'm here to teach you what I know about this island. So open up your sea chart and make it snappy.
there's a real peculiar cave draw uh, toward the back side of here dragon roost island wait what i doubt you'll ever get there to see it unless you manage to sprout wings and f okay that's all i can teach you but i will do this for you since i'm feeling generous i'll send word to all my brethren living near the islands of the great sea good bunch of fish if you see a fish leaping out of the water when you sail near the island sail up to it yeah we know and they have advice as well oh you there you kingly red lion guy that's it i've repaid my debt i'm done you take care of the rest repaid your debt what was that about care to explain repaid my debt what was the debt no i think we'll just be letting it ride for a while one two four spaces and i only have three bait so i might as well put them in the items though Even though I don't need this island right now, I do feel like I should get the fish. Just so I remember where this island is. It's just right there. X. Yeah, I should have got more bait. I didn't think I'd be going so far so early. I guess I don't remember this game that well. Hoy, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. I take it you want to chart information. I don't need any information about this island. I just want the chart. Fire Mountain. We'll skip this. We need the ice arrows. I don't think I can get those until I get like the boots or something I think those are like end game end game content oh shit if anyone is wondering um, the phone call that I had was my brother he had uh, some issues that he's going with and he wanted my advice even though i don't think i could really give my advice on it but um hopefully everything is okay i got my own problems though so i can't really be of much help i just got my teeth fixed and um hopefully i could get done with all my other issues that I got to deal with since the teeth thing was just so random and um, out of nowhere it's fucking dentist I've never had a good experience at the dentist I'd say that it always feels like they mess up or something I think because my teeth just are like they're straight but they are a little oddly shaped some teeth are some teeth are a lot bigger than others. Some teeth are like very sharp. So they dig into others and they easily like I think one time my my uh, one of my tooths cracked the other one just because it was so sharp. So but I haven't needed any um, dental wear or braces or whatever. So I guess that means my teeth are OK. I remember when I was a kid, I was so upset with the dentist that I was thinking like uh, when I saw old people with uh, dentures, I wanted those. I thought it would be, oh wait, did I skip the fish? I did. I thought it would just be easier just to have dentures and just take them out, put them in, but uh, it's kind of silly. Now that I'm older. Just give me some fake teeth.
got dark so fast. Oh, I can't have more than 200. I thought I needed to get a big pouch or something. Big money bag. I remember wasting so many um, coins in the last, rupees in the last game from having too many coins and being maxed out. Maybe it's 500 or something. Do you not see what rises from the horizon? That is where you must go, Miyuku, the forest haven. Ah, oh, this music. It appears as though this is but a great tree rising far above the ocean's surface, but it is also a sacred place. It is inside the grotto that you will find the spirit of the earth, the great Deku tree. You must speak with the Deku tree and receive from him the sacred gem known as Farore's Pearl. I fear that Ganon's vile hands may have already reached this most sacred of sanctuaries. Go forth with caution, Miyuku. Let's get more bait. Let's get one of those pearls or pears, pear heads. Thank you. Bye. The music went away. It was playing that nice um, forest music. Boko Baba. Oh wait, shit! It says something about it. Oh, well. I forgot what it's useful for. Making potions, I think. Oh shit. I forgot about him. Oh wait, nope. Not yet. Oh shit. I gotta get used to that still. There we go, music's back. I feel like this Deku tree looks kind of weird. Got that big, like, lower lip, single tooth. 
giant cartoon nose than like the previous Deku tree which looked uh, a lot more like an ancient tree. This kind of looks like some weird ogre hybrid. Jelly Chew. Inside is a magical gel in the set. Okay. <laughs> I must apologize. I was in error. I saw your clothing and suddenly I felt a longing for an age gone by. That longing caused the ancient tongue to pass my lips. I am the guardian spirit of this forest haven, the Deku Tree. I owe you my thanks and for your aid and riddle and riding me up, ridding me of those foul creatures. Tell me, was it not the King of Red Lions, the boat who speaks, who led you to this place? So it is true. When you have come here because you have needed, need of the Pearl of the Goddess, I see I knew there was a reason the monsters had begun to congregate in the region around my wood. Now I understand it. He has returned, Ganon has returned. In that case, I must make haste. Koroks, little children of the woods, this traveler is not your enemy. Let your heart be at ease and show yourselves. I wonder if this tree is the tree that linked to the path or Ocarina of Time planted that was supposed to grow. Because that tree looked a lot cuter than what it grew into, if that's the case. Because they do talk about Ocarina of Time in this game, the Hero of Time. What do you call yourself, Miraku? Well then, Miraku. These are the Kuroks, the spirits of the forest. Once upon a time long ago, the Kuroks took on human form. Uh, but when they came to live on the sea, they took these shapes. Now they fear people, but to me, they will ever be my cherished little children. So they used to be people. As it happens, you have come just in time for a ceremony that the Kuroks hold, but once every year it is about to begin. I shall grant the pearl to you once the ceremony is complete. I must apologize for my brief delay, but if the ceremony is not completed soon, an ill fate could befall us, so let it begin. Are you ready, my children? We are not a great Deku tree. Something terrible has happened. It's Makar, Makar. What is the matter, Linder? You and Makar are always late. No, no, it is not that, oh great Deku Tree. Makar fell into the Forbidden Woods. The Forbidden Woods? I told him to be careful, but still Makar flew above the Forbidden Woods, and as he drew close to it... Foolish little Makar. Miriku, have you heard all this? The Forbidden Woods are right beside the Hollowed Islands of our forest haven, those woods. The whole region is a vile place that is home to evil beasts. And now it seems they have taken a child of the forest named Makar. Your presence here is no mistake, I dream. The King of Red Lions likely expects great deeds from you. It is why he brought you here. I am sorry to ask this of you, but can you go rescue young Makar for me? But great Deku tree, people cannot fly through the air. Ah, uh, yes, thank you, child. You are right. It is not possible to enter those woods from the seas, it is. Or is it? Miriku, I would guess from your size that you are heavier than my Kurok children. Yet I think we may still be able to solve this dilemma. You must use the item I shall bestow upon you and fly through the sky. that face just for a, a leaf I wonder if you go inside his mouth if there's a a dungeon like Ocarina of Time forgive me Miraku but could you climb up to that crown and get that leaf from up there 
I'm pretty sure one of them can get it, right? It's not that heavy. And they already fly on leaves anyway, so... Oh, whoops. Okay. Well, I guess this is kind of useful now. I don't have to take it off. Get in there. Almost there. And... Alright. Plant your feet on the ground and use it to blow blasts of air at objects and enemies. Swordsman over here. Please, you must fly from over there to here. Use. Oh, yeah. Wonder if I need. I don't think I need the Wii U to start up the or the wii u gamepad to start up the wii u right i just can use a pro controller right hopefully because that way i don't need to keep picking this thing up and turning it on with it i just hate picking it up using it as a controller and then storing it away i think that's probably the reason why i don't use the uh the Wii U. I don't think anyone likes giant controllers. Oh wait, no, the baton is here. It's like I'm holding a tablet or something, which I don't really want. stop soon. I uh, feel like I need to eat something. But let's try and get to the forest first. I don't want to have to do this when I first get back. Come on. Alright, there we go. Back off. I remember I was watching somebody play the game and they didn't know you could do that. And I was surprised, but I mean... I don't think I knew I could do that my first time around, so... It's whatever. <sighs> uh, I'm tired. I'll stop here. Let's kill these real quick. Save and I'll be done. Right, I'll see you guys another time. Thanks for watching. Bye.